The Page Layout tab adjusts your page settings and what is seen. If your spreadsheet is being printed, it is recommended that you adjust these settings to make sure the final hard copy looks good. In the Page Layout tab, you'll find margins, orientation, size, grid lines, headings, and the adjusting of column width and heights. To adjust your margins, select the Page Layout tab, and then the Margins drop-down. You can choose from a range of built-in options, or create your own custom margins. Either use the up or downwards arrow to increase or decrease, or use your keyboard to type in the right size. You can also change the orientation from landscape to portrait in the, by selecting the orientation drop-down and then selecting portrait or landscape. When you do this, you'll notice little faint dashes appear on your screen in your spreadsheet. These identify the borders of one printed page. Have a look and see if you can see them. You can also adjust your page size. To do this, find the page layout tab, find the size option, and select from more pre-built-in paper sizes, like A4, A5, or A3. The light gray cell borders that you see when you open a spreadsheet are called grid lines. Without them, it would be very hard to see where you're putting in data. You can turn the grid line view on and off in the Page Layout tab. Select Page Layout, find the Sheet Options group, and select grid lines. If you select and toggle the view option, you'll see them remove and reappear on your screen. If you toggle the print option, they will print off this, um, the grid lines when you print your spreadsheet. You can also show the headings the headings is the row with the cell identifiers on it. The A, the B, the C, the D, and the 1, 2, 3, and the 4. To do this, find the Page Layout tab, Sheet Options group, and the headings. Click on the view, and you'll see them disappear. You can click on and off to toggle it. If you want these in your printout, Select the print option, and when you print your spreadsheet, they will be on it.